How's it going, everybody? Decisive TV here. We're back on the Let's Play world, and all of our crops have grown. <laughs> Today, I kind of plan on doing a little bit of building, uh, if that is all right with you guys. Uh, I wanted to go ahead and make a spot for specifically for uh, our um, our enchanting table, and I think. Uh, I do have an idea. I don't know exactly how it's going to turn out. Hopefully it turns out pretty good, but um, I guess you guys will probably see. It's probably in the thumbnail of this, this video, actually, but, you know, it's the, the journey of getting there that matters the most, right? So I kind of want to make it out of Deep Slate, but I also want it to feel uh, pretty, like, fantasy-esque. So there's going to be, like, a bit of warp stem, some... Uh, some of that stuff, so uh, that should be pretty, pretty awesome. So I actually decided to make a uh, stone cutter because I needed a bunch of these deep slate bricks, I think is probably what I want to use. Uh, I think I might also want to use some of these deep slate tiles because these are like pretty dark, right? And then it gets a little bit lighter and then we can use like regular deep slate. Kind of make like a, a granite or, or a granite, <laughs> a gradient uh, utilizing these blocks from like dark to lighter, I think. Um, but yeah, I kind of just want to go for like a wizard tower <laughs> kind of feel, I think. That's what I want to do. So we need a we need to venture back into the nether. We got to we got to put our blocks away. We got to adventure into the nether and find some of this warp stem. Uh, I, I made a brand new axe, so we should be okay. We should be able to get quite a bit. Uh, hopefully enough to... Oh my god! No. No, stop. Stop. I don't have that many arrows. Eh. Please. Oh my god. Yes. Oh my god. Okay, I just ran out of arrows. Uh, and there's another one over here. The way that we need to go, of course, return the sender at least. Mm, boop. Oh, well. Yoink. Oh, that missed. Eh. Okay. We gotta get back down there. I don't remember how to get down. This way? This looks pretty dangerous, to be honest. Maybe I just ran, like, all the way over here, but... How are you guys doing today? I gotta ask every single episode, because obviously, you know, there's some people who have bad days and they kind of just need a rant. Oh my god. And I hope... Oh my god, stop. Yeah. Oh, that was so close. Oh, come on. Please. You blew up my staircase. Oh my god, and you burned me. Ah. Stop. Oh my gosh, man. I'm just burning. Okay. Well, that was, uh... Yeah. No, 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 Please just hit it. Uh, please. Oh, oh no. Okay. Uh. Oh, that was so close. Oh, oh, that wasn't. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay, we just gotta, we gotta get, gotta get the uh, the warp stem and get out of here. This is what I need. I need the blue. The doubloons. <clears throat> oh, hi. Eh. Oh, how did that not hit you? Go away, go away. But what? what? Okay, there we go. What the heck was that, man? Alright, uh, let's go ahead and get out of here. I think 
this honestly probably won't be enough. We might have to come back, but I probably won't show that on camera if I need to. Oh my gosh, every single time I come back tonight. Eh. Uh, okay, let's go ahead. We'll grab a bit of this. Uh, actually, I don't, I don't think I need the oak logs. I mean, I might make the staircase leading up out of oak stairs, maybe, but... Mm, mm. Where do we want to put this thing, actually? I didn't really plan out an area. I think up on the mountain would be pretty cool, but... Uh, I don't know. Maybe, you know what? Maybe we just put it by the shore. It seems like we're p putting a bunch of our, like, useful things over by the shore, so we have to run from our base over to here <laughs> quite a bit. But uh, I think next to the shore would be pretty cool. It'd almost be like a lighthouse without it being a lighthouse instead of it's a wizard tower which i guess cooler all right let's go ahead we'll lay this thing out so i think i want to have it i think i want to have it five wide five and then this will be five and then this should be five yeah so i think I think that's a fairly decent size. We're definitely going to need more deep slate. Oh my god. Well, actually... You know what would be cool? If we did a... Kind of like ruined wizard tower in a way. I think that might be pretty awesome. Okay, so I kind of want to... We'll do something like this. I don't want to replace all of this with the deep slate tiles like probably mix in a few of this stuff uh but we'll do majority of it probably as deep slate tiles let's go ahead and do that. uh yeah i think something like that, I mean, that's all the materials that I had. That's all the deep slate that I had. I should have prepared more, but uh, I kind of just wanted to hop onto the world and get uh, something <laughs> something done. Um, okay, let's go ahead and hop in the middle here. Carve out a little, um, little hole for ourselves. Let's go ahead and just replace these. Boom. Um, let's go ahead. We'll also do something like uh i think i mean i guess i had a bunch more deep slate technically with these deep slate tiles i didn't need nearly as many as i thought i was going to need um and then i kind of want to do something with the warp stem that might be pretty awesome in a way so we'll do i kind of want it um, let's go ahead we'll just make a few of these type of blocks so i kind of want it to almost be like like vines in a way i think would be pretty awesome so we can do something like that do that and then maybe we will have it like go into the floor i think could be cool um, I should definitely get some more of those, uh, the, the warped, um, the warped forest, like, vines, or whatever they're called. Uh, let's go ahead and make a few more. Boom. Do that, and then do that. Oh, yeah, so I actually moved the bamboo, so we got quite a bit more, uh, but I just moved it from the inside of the house over to right there. That's probably a better spot anyway, right? <laughs> uh, so I know, yeah, we got that warp nylium from the Enderman last episode. Uh, so I guess, do I have any? No, I don't have any nether rags. So uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and go back into the nether. We're going to gather up some nether rack and... Oh, wait, do I have any bones, actually? Yes, I do. Okay. 
So we'll just head back into the nether, gather up some netherrack. Oh, I did bring shears. Oh my gosh, I'm uh, a genius halfway. I completely forgot that you needed shears in order to gather up the uh, some of the warp stuff. Uh, okay, let's make our way down. Gotta replace that. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, no, you don't. Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. Never mind. Oh, well, I mean, I guess a little bit of grass you do. Can you use boat meal on this? Oh my god, you can. Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and use shears to gather up some of this. Just gather up a bunch of this stuff. We want, we want all of it. I think that will probably be good. Oh, don't look at the Enderman by accident. Okay, so we'll go ahead and make some of these warped planks and warped stairs. And we'll kind of add, um, like little bits and pieces of a roof i think so we'll add like those and then we can add like little other bits around just around the tower make it known that like yeah there was like a roof here at one point Okay, so yeah, I think something like this is pretty cool. Um, it kind of looks like it's overgrown with like this weird, like magical forest sort of stuff. Uh, with a little bit of the roof kind of around here, uh, made an accidental pathway like right there. That's pretty cool. Um, spreading out a bunch of these warped roots and uh, nether sprouts. Um, I need to go get more bone meal because it takes like one to spread the warp nylium across. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. But we should also probably just make our enchanting table. Um, <clears throat> I think it's just going to be laid out like right here, like right in the middle. Uh, I, yeah, I think something like that would be nice. Let's go ahead and take that. Uh, maybe I should put warped nylium in here as well but we'll see we'll see what it looks like when it, with the enchanting table and everything in there four obsidian two diamonds in a book makes the enchanting table and we have 13 bookshelves uh, i think we need 15 or 16 in order to get a full level 30 enchant but i'm not 100 percent sure uh, i think i also want to take the lapis out and maybe make a chest that we can just put over there. So we're not having to come back uh, all the time to get lapis. Oh, right. I also needed to get the rest of these bones. Bone meal. Nice. So let's go ahead and head back. Also, sorry. I, uh, <clears throat> I think I'm getting sick again. So if my voice sounds pretty raspy, that's mostly the reason why. <laughs> Okay, let's see, expand that. Uh, let's go ahead and expand this a little bit. We got to use this fairly wisely, and I feel like I just did not do that. <laughs> Oops. I feel like I spread it out not in the direction that I needed to. Yeah, it is what it is. Okay, so enchantment table down. We'll put the bookshelves down like that oh that's that's actually kind of nice kind of like that um i should make i should make this a little bit something like that so it's not it doesn't feel nearly as cramped whenever you walk in maybe <laughs> let's go ahead put those books and 26 okay so yeah we need a little bit more for the bookshelves uh, bookshelf wise let's let's place that there okay um i think 
think we should also put a little bit of lighting just hidden behind the bookshelves a little bit. Uh, that way it, no weird stuff can spawn around here and blow up our stuff. Not be very fun. Let's go ahead and put this chest down too. I completely forgot about that. Left us in there. Okay. Um. Oh my god. There, why is there two creepers next to that? Oh my god. There's a skeleton. There's so many mobs. Why? I feel like they increased the creeper spawn rate. I feel like throughout these six episodes, I have seen more creepers than I have in the past 13 or 12 years, 13 years of playing this game. Oh my god. Make it day. It's scary. Um. Oh, uh, sugar cane. Yes. Eh. Nope, nope. Stop. Leave. <laughs> Run! Oh my god. Please tell me I didn't... Okay, I didn't look at that. He's just teleporting for no reason. Man, this game is stressful, isn't it? Uh, okay, cows. Oh my god! Yeah, Get out of my crops! Ah! Uh. Oh my goodness. Let's just let's just get this. I know there's another creeper somewhere, but I don't know where. There's actually like another three creepers somewhere. Okay, they aren't around that though. Oh my god, that chest is filling up quick. Uh okay, let's just go ahead. I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna breathe you guys up before, you know, some of you get made into bookshelves. Sorry. Oh, I accidentally gave this sheep one. No. Okay. Two books. Three. Uh, so that's four. Five. Six books. I just need... I need... I need... I'm wearing down my, my cow count. Uh-oh. I accidentally hit the babies too. So that's 12 books. I think that should be... An oh my god, how did you get out? Oh, never mind. <laughs> the baby ran back in. Okay, let's go ahead. Make some of these. Make some of those. Make some of the these. Perfect amounts. Holy. Okay, four bookshelves. That should be all right. Cows are still doing okay. Even though uh, mass genocide just happened. Um... Uh, that oh my god no no uh, we have level 30 enchant but at what cost man you know what put a crafting table there it's all right okay, let's go ahead and make a door as well i kind of want to put a should not have made an oak door yeah gotta put this the other way because of the stair nice okay that that's awesome <clears throat> sorry my voice is starting to go out so i think i might have to wrap this episode up soon but uh what can we I, I can't put any of this stuff on there oh my god that's so dumb man why can why can you not do that it's not cool uh okay well now we have level 30 and we are we're at level 28, or well, level 27, almost 28, but we will have a level 30 enchant next episode. Actually, I think I might go around and see if I can get some XP. Okay, so I decided to come into the nether uh, because quartz actually... Oh my gosh, never mind, I don't want to grab that quartz. Quartz gives the most XP out of any orb, uh, or ore. I believe so we should be able to get up to level 30 pretty quick as you can see i'm already level 29 and it's going up really fast i think it's also because it's like the biggest veins so there's a lot just a lot more um ores to mine and xp to get but we did hit level 30 so let's go ahead and head back and we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and enchant our first item <clears throat> with my my sick raspy voice right now 
Okay, obviously we have to do the pick first because it's fortune three. I will take it. Sadly, there was no unbreaking on it, but you know, that's all right. Efficiency four for the shovel. Oh, that would be so nice too. Our first enchanted item. Oh my goodness. Efficiency four, fortune three. Now we can actually get like more ores. We can get more diamonds. We can get a whole bunch of other stuff. So that's freaking amazing. Uh, that's such a, a lucky first enchant in my opinion. But yeah, so I think that's going to be it for this video. My voice is starting to go. So uh, yeah, I kind of had to wrap it up quick. Um, let me know what you guys think of our wizard tower ruin thing. I, I don't even know. It's more of like a wizard hut. <laughs> I think if the roof is just going to be right there. Um, but yeah, maybe like obviously as we progress through the game, we get more of these enchants. I can start doing bigger and better projects. But yeah, that's going to be it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new here. We've had so many new faces and there's so many wholesome comments. I just, I can't believe it. It's absolutely amazing. So thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day. Bye-bye.